Hello everybody and um, welcome to the Julian the King channel and in today's video I will be doing a Takis mukbang. Now um, I used to think that there was only these two flavors because I only saw those two at the store but um, when I was looking at the store I saw like a box that had like 18 of these packs so we now have two new flavors and I believe they were um, one of the three when these came out. Because um, these three are, I think, the originals. And um, this one, I think, is the new one. Because I remember uh, my mom, she bought it when um, it came out or something. Like, I heard they were pretty good. So, let's start pouring. Oh, one of them dropped. is like has three layers so I'll just put the trash on the second one.
for the crunchy fajitas. Um, yeah, let me check the bag. But yeah, it says crunchy fajitas. These are actually crustier and more crunchier than the um, original Takis. So they're kind of hard to chew. And, and they got a whole different texture. Like, it's just kind of weird, but... Like, it almost feels like flat. But... So it says crunchy fingers. It kind of tastes like, um, something. Like, it has, like, a meaty texture. And, like, um, I don't know. But... I'm just giving me the feeling that I'm like biting down into like a taco. So.
here. The tray is finished. So, um, Takis. The reason I chose to do this mukbang is because. The reason I chose to do this mukbang is because Takis are my favorite snack. Like, I could eat Takis over any other chip, but, um. So I decided to do a mukbang, and, um. After I got my hands on the box of 18 Taki singles, I decided I would get four of the all flavors and I would try them. Now obviously, for those who really love Takis, you might be wondering, if I had all flavors, where's the guacamole flavor? Well, the Takis box that comes with many bags of all four flavors does not come with guacamole yet. But next time, I will try and get guacamole. Um, I believe I saw a few of them at the store where I get my Takis. But um, I'll try to get guacamole next time. Anyway, uh, as you can see here, this room is kind of new. So um, I'm going to show you guys around the new studio. So um, for my mukbang, I uh, decided to get this table. It has uh, three layers. I got this from Ikea. And um, it just really comes in helpful when you've got like all these talking bags. And um, like, we, I got like a poster. And then uh, there's the couch. Um, I actually used to have a couch in my sister's room. But my sister didn't really like the couch because it was like cluttering up her space. So my mom decided to put this in the studio. So. And up here we just got like um, random stuff. Because before um, I actually used this as a studio. It used to be like a closet. So we have some stuff. And that's uh, this weird stuffed animal. Yeah. And um. I have like a bunch of pens and like I have some notebooks over there. So like yeah. And also outside of the studio, like it's really cramped, so just gotta oh. uh, Yeah. And then over here is my like mom's bedroom. Picture studio, so Alright guys, thank you guys for watching my mukbang. If you really enjoyed it, I will, um, I already made two previous mukbangs, so, um, please check out my other YouTube videos, and, um, I've recently started doing YouTube shorts, and, uh, since I did that, I just got 40 more subscribers. So, thank you guys for watching my YouTube shorts. And, um, I'm gonna try to do, like, funny, like, funny shorts, and, and, like, abandoned building shorts, because that's what I... That's what seems to blow up on my channel the most. And uh, if you guys think I should make a new type of shorts, uh, just let me know. Anyway, thank you guys for watching my video. Bye.